uh, Kalon. We're going to listen to his song Falling first. pronunciation do you think uh it sounds good to me for now <laughs> cool well this one really stuck out to me um when i listened to this kind of music actually i listened to this type of music only heavier times 10 pretty much like 12 hours a day at least um so i enjoy this a lot i enjoy his guitar tone a lot i enjoyed the music um and one of the things that makes or breaks it for me is vocals and so at first i wasn't so sure but his vocals really grew on me like quickly and um i believe it sounds to me like he's from a different country i think that i read he's italian but i could be wrong all right quick tangent here joe just a quick <laughs> tangent it's i feel like Not it's, a rant? no it's well oh. it might lead to one but it's serendipitous that Chief Carlos is in the room from the Lounge Network, and uh, the guy there. Yeah, he's he has a really nice take on this point I'm about to get to, which is it just amazes me like how it's kind of the norm now for even lesser known, brand new indie bands to have a video on YouTube. You know, when you go back to like early '80s and MTV, it was like how many bands had a video, like a nice produced video. One of the first things like, they do these a days. few. So yeah, now that's like part of the press pack now, and it could be done yep. so inexpensively, and uh, yeah, I mean that that's what uh, Carlos at the Lounge Network, thank you, does uh, regularly with his uh, artists. But <laughs> anyway, all right. So this band, I know this is your type of music. Uh, what kind of popped out at me in terms of the production? Because you know, I can't help it. Is <laughs> His vocal sounded really dry. I mean, it was great, like great song, a lot of like production was really good. But for this style of music, it doesn't seem to me that dry vocals works. Like, did, did you think about that? It's like, I don't know, because when it's really dry, which is complete lack of reverb, then any type of like glitch in your vocals gets, you know, highlighted. Yeah, I didn't think they're it was too dry. I actually thought it was. You liked it? Oh, like even in the chorus, like that the da da that part yeah. it like really overdoes it. I mean, not overdoes it, but it over almost overpowers the music for a second. Um, yeah, but I think it. I think he did a bunch of layers, you know, a bunch of stacks. It might. It's either that or like tonally. I was longing. It's a for... very high pitched voice. Yeah. There's like no low end to his voice at all. Yeah, he can wail, but like tonally, I I longed for some more low end in the mix. Mm -hmm. You know that, but that's about it, man. It was I, I enjoyed it. Yeah, I like the video a lot too. That's probably what drew me to it mostly is when I was watching the videos. Very well, very well made. 